today I am unboxing a piece from NAG called the PS78. Uh, just a couple of things though before I get to unboxing this. Uh, for one, yes, I know you've seen my face and you know what I look like. Why are you wearing a mask? Blah, blah, blah. It's because I just don't feel like showing my face right now. It's just how it is. Uh, another thing is, you won't believe the day I've had trying to track this fucking thing. Um... <laughs> It's not Nikos' fault. Nikos is actually very kind and very helpful with all of this. Um, it was just my local post office. They decided to uh, give me a phrase I've never heard of, which is, uh, I think it was, given to the delivery driver for further delivery? Uh, something along those lines, and uh, just confused the shit out of me. Um, I didn't even get a notification on my watch. So, uh, yeah, it was very exciting to open this. Um, yeah, let's shut up and get into it. <laughs> uh, this is, like I said, a NAG PS78. I'm sure he'll have the tag on here so that you know how to contact him and everything. Um, if you are getting into NAG, though, uh, I would look at the different Myers sculpts that he has because he has a lot of really good Michael Myers sculpts. This isn't, this is just one of those sculpts. Uh, I got this one because I just love the castle look to it. Uh, I believe that Nick Castle has the meanest stretch. So, uh, yeah, I mean, try not to show my address. Ah, I see it. I'll show you what I see. Woo! That is a beauty. All right, I'm going to take my mask off so I can get a very good look at the detail so uh yeah we're gonna move now don't mind this area because this is used for painting some of my masks so you can tell like right here is paint with liquid latex and it is a bitch to clean up so uh anyway getting right into the nag mask pull that out you can see the tag let me get a closer look nag nikos dracios his website, his details, everything you need to know, it'll also be in the description. So, I'm going to be very careful with this guy. Oh, wow. I can already tell the hair is going to be awesome. Nice pull. Love it. All right. I've been excited as hell about this ever since I placed the order. So, here, let me give you guys a better look. All right. Whew. That's a damn good mask. Holy goodness. A good look at the tag right here. Whew. If that's not a 78 mask, I don't know what is. Goodness. Nick, you've done it. Even got the mouth hole right there. Ears are really good. The hair is amazing. Wow. Oh yeah, this is definitely going to be my go-to H1. So, uh, yeah, let me put them on a stand real fast, and I'll give a comparison to every other mask I have. Before I do that, I just wanted to show you the, uh, it says, NAG 21 PS78 Special, signed by Nikos. You can't really see it that well, but that's what it says. All right, so I have a couple of H1s over to this side to compare to this one. Um, I'm not comparing anything based on, you know, accuracy or anything. I'm just giving you guys a good visual on what the PS78 is. Uh, over here we have the, uh, almost said nag, <laughs> the Night Owl Creep. This is one of my favorites. Uh, I think this perfectly captures the image of Nick Castle holding the mask in the behind-the-scenes photos of 1978. Um, very good. I dressed the hair up myself. Uh, really good mask, uh, especially if you're looking to get into the higher end mask. Especially this one, the OGS 78 by Dallas Alexander or Shape Killer Studios on Instagram. Um, this mask is beautiful. Uh, everything down from the weathering to the hair even. The hair is beautiful. Um, but yeah, and the PS 78 has that nice Kirk sorry, Kirk, uh, has this nice uh, castle stretch sculpted into it, which is really nice, especially if you want to get more of those uh, 
uh, phone scene pictures and more of those hallway uh, pictures that you'd want. Uh, but like I said, I'm not saying any of these are better. I'm not saying any of these are bad. I'm just comparing them to the Nag Mask. Um, Nikos has been in the game for a while. I'm not exactly sure for how long. Uh, but I rem remember going through his YouTube, his last YouTube video, or his first YouTube video was in 2008. So, uh, he's been doing this a really long time. Uh, I believe this is one of the best H1s that you can spend your money on. Um, I'll have a link to his info in the description below so that if you guys are interested, I can definitely leave you guys a link. And, uh, like I said, if you're going to nag and you're looking to get a mask from him, this is not his only sculpt. So, you're getting your money's worth either way. Uh, but yeah, that's it. As far as the comparisons go, would I recommend this? Absolutely. Absolutely. It is a very good mask and it just captures that castle look that you're looking for. Uh, especially the phone scene, which I will give a little bit, there we go, a little bit of an angle for you. Absolutely outstanding mask, and I am very much pleased. So, yeah, if you guys liked this video, obviously like it. Hit the subscribe button, follow me on Instagram at the Horror Freak TV, and TikTok, Halloween Man underscore 78. I will see you guys in the next video.